President Tunembu hits the ground running after landing from France ordered release of food reserves from national reserves to enhance food availability in the country. In a significant development, Minister of Information Idris Mohammed has revealed that President Tunembu is set to order the release of food items from the national food reserves. This move aims to bolster food availability across the nation, addressing concerns about food security. The announcement follows a crucial meeting held by the Special President Committee on Emergency Food Intervention at the Presidential Villa. Minister Mohammed emphasized a government commitment to collaborating with major millers and commodity traders to elevate food prices, thus easing the burden on consumers. Notably, this breaking news comes shortly after President Tunibus return to the country following a 13-day trip to France. The timing of this initiative underscores the administration's proactive approach to addressing pressing issues and ensuring the welfare of Nigerian citizens. Well, <laughs> all this one they are coming out to tell us that the president came back. Okay, we don't hear, but that they immediately went into a meeting and is ordering. We don't hear now. We're going to scores. There must be follow-up to ensure it gets to where it is intended. Yes, one thing that kills the government. You see a government who is actually doing little, little for him. You know? You see a government that does little... What's it called? They're, they're actually coming out and they're working. But the thing is, fellow Nigerians like me and you, people like me and you that have allowed themselves to be used by, should I say, the, God, the devil, they will come outside and they're going to block that thing from coming to pass. I kid you not. We should be protesting heavily in the streets of this country. That's the only language these wicked leaders understand. The best solution is to restore the subsidy. Simple. It's not a simple law. <laughs> do you know how many men have stayed without subsidy? Mr. President, do something about the full price. All this hunger will stop. <laughs> hmm? Tudumbu Bobo is just wasted time. He's just wasted time in, as Nigeria president. Will the food end up in the belly of the masses? No data, no effective monitoring. This man is really not serious. You think the release of food will reduce the hardship in a country where everything depends on dollar? How many people eat the food and how many days will they eat the food? As many that contributed in bringing these difficult times to Nigerians, you will never see peace, including their family members. Take a chill pill. Hmm? Oh. Small, small. The main thing here is that, oh. I'm going to say, have you people learned, to, have we learned our lessons? Have we learned our lessons? Hmm. Oh. It is a collate to where, in the first place, we chose to believe the government when they say food reserves are released. When has such release affected prices or made more food available? What food item did they release? How come the government agents will just issue statements which are bogus in nature and nobody interrogates it? It will circulate, meaning what? I don't know. No, I, I, me, for me, whatever the government says, I don't actually believe it until I start feeling it or seeing it here. There they go again, a bag of rice for a community of 200 fools. <laughs> Releasing food reserve for the nation by the nation and for the nation. Good. But at what market price? I think the government needs to have a nationwide mega supermarket where government sponsored control price will lead the pact to strive to price stability. We need and was must begin to grow what we want to reap in the next future harvest. Well, to to an extent you have a point. Sharing palliative is nonsense. It can give it cannot give it cannot give a lasting solution. The, the distributor will still pack them to their own usage and just open borders for import and extra export. That is just the solution. So they are saying whether you come outside and you distribute rice. And truly, to me, how many rice you want even distribute? It's not the one that happened like you know, the, during that time that subsidy happens now. Subsidy actually happened. I, I say subsidy happened. That COVID-19 time that they, they hoarded it and they kept it until when? Then, when they now saw it, what happened to it? Even some players, as in 
some people were not even still able to get it they were saying they will give you they'll come and give you one <laughs> one small bag of one quarter bag of rice for a whole community you're about to clap for him blind people i pity you now but but not all because they were wise yes now they are not it's not living that are supporting him blindly whether i like it or not i've told us that there are people who actually supported to because they felt he was actually the you know he was really going to work but now that he is not doing he's not working i like the i also love the way rather they have come out and they're like no baba this is not what you promised us do what you said you're going to do why make the same mistake all the time but harry did the same last the same thing last year or two years ago no no it was not two years ago it was 2020 subsidy removal shouldn't be a problem but our inability to grow what we will eat as a nation nigeria is blessed with good lands rich enough to feed the whole africa if agriculture sector is developed all around the year nigeria should be producing all manner of foods if you think we but what projects are we embarking on this year my governor is renovating the hotel for 17.18 billion but our local government does not have tractors hmm. okay so you don't hear around. me i feel this thing they are coming this thing they are doing is not really going to it's not going to do much that is what i know not what i feel it will not do much why this is not tackling the problem from the root cause whenever you assume or you yes you resume tackling the problem without tackling from the root cause you are just you're just 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 at the end of the day nothing will be done it will just be as if you know you even made things even worse or it will be as if nothing naturally happened Mr. Presido, I laugh in Latin. I've collected my own story, story, story. Four subsidies gone and it is gone forever. No Jupiter will bring it back. Lie, lie. All the beneficiary of free money called first subsidies should look to another business direction. Enemies of Nigeria. I actually supported the comments that said the government should go into the production of agriculture. Me, I, f I know that. Look, what the, what the government should do is not just production of food, but we should learn to create another means of revenue. Whether it is the agricultural sector, whether it is the mining sector, the gold, the soil in Zamfara, they should create another means of what? That is my own. They should create another means of, um, what's it called? Another means of revenue, not just one. If they create another means of revenue, everything will not just be on floor even a human being as a human being as, as a human being if you have only one stream of income your own is completely finished yes not finished completely so the government should you know emulate that create more you know create more um what's it called more means of revenue and in creating that you know things will gradually fall in. and of course block the leakages we're going to be creating more means of revenue and the people who are just sitting down and they're collecting it Eh? All right, on this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come your week next time, enjoy the rest of your day.